you guys how's it going it's Hyde here and we're back with a brand new episode of odd sparks and in the last episode we started automating some planks we actually ended up over here and we started making some crafty sparks which we don't have a whole pile of right now but we do have some and it seems like they make things a little bit faster for us, which is good. So going forward, we're going to have to start upgrading these a little bit and getting some more of those guys going. But for now, I currently have 20, 40, 60, 80 wooden planks. I think we needed 70 to complete the next missions, plural. And that should be enough to do both of them. I don't remember who needed what anymore. Deliver 10. Um, yes, you give me the signs. So we'll give you 10 of these. Perfect. She nods in approval and hands you several detailed blueprints ready to be used. Her lips curl into a satisfied and proud smile. Oh. Signs to make marks on the map. Crate that sparks can put items in and take items from splitters and crossings to better instruct sparks where to go yeah. try them out sign crate crossing splitter i i'm pretty sure i understand how all that stuff works so it's all fine and dandy this guy wants 60 planks he is being all greedy there you go have those mm -hmm. perfect for now, this wood workshop can only make some wooden blade. Not good for much other than training and household uses, but it's a start. Mm -hmm. If the merchant complains about wanting something more useful, just ignore them. Haha, <laughs> it's their job to figure out what to do with what any of us make anyway. Okay, so now we have to make wooden blades. That seems pretty simple. Complete the quest with the merchant. Oh! Kill the field bunnies. We've done that. Perfect. I forgot we did that mission. So we can go hand in this one as well. We're running out of quests, guys. It's not looking good for us. Oh, no. We're almost at the end of the demo. Okay. In one hit, you say? Huh. That's much better than I expected. They looked so cute. I thought they wouldn't be able to do much. Here's a little something for your time. Some more aether shards. Oh. Okay, okay. Let's just skip the forest bunnies. Do you think your sparks can hunt a Belafont? Oh. I've heard that there's that there's only the docile type in the woodlands near the village, so they shouldn't be too dangerous. Kill a Belafont. The merchant wants to give you a bigger challenge and to use the sparks to defeat the Belafont. They can be found around the birch trees. They may seem docile, but they can be very dangerous. You should take as many sparks as you can with you. I'm pretty sure the Belafent will need more than just one hit, and I've seen that trunk break bones. Mm. Don't get yourself hurt, all right? The mayor is going to give me an earful. I like how this guy just sends us off to go kill some giant passive creature. He's worried about getting attacked, but he's like, let's fight in Belafont. They don't hurt anyone. Anyway, whatever. A quest is a quest is a quest. Let's do it. Take these guys. He said to also take as many of these things as we can. Now, I don't know if... E. Can, can these guys, like, break down bigger trees? No. <laughs> no, they cannot. He can't even get up. Okay, let's cancel that. Cancel that guy, then. What's the point? What is the point of this guy? Does it... Does he kill these trees faster? Absolutely not. Okay, so these guys are useless when it comes to... Like... Real world stuff. They're basically... I think specifically for crafting. Alright. And we're looking for maple trees? The heck do I find a Belafont from... Maple trees? What do maple trees look like on the map even? I don't... I don't know. Did it say maple trees? I can't remember. Belafont. Notebook. Quest log. Uh, can be found birch. Birch trees. Okay, we gotta find some like white trees with black spots. That's a birch, right? I'm pretty sure. 
Just keep running around until we find some of those. What do we have here? You extend your hand, touch the shrine, blah, blah, blah. The choppy spark. We need 15 stumpies and five blades. Ooh. Okay, we can't do that right now. But at least we can keep that on our radar. The choppy spark shrine. Oh, hang on. Gotta make sure we don't leave any good stuff behind. What's the situation here? You are leaving the demo area. Okay, so stay out of the black zones. What's this? Able to carry more items. <gasps> oh! What? An ancient stone stands in front of you. Clearly magical in some way. Holds forbidden information. This carving this shrine is locked and not available in the demo. Oh, come on. Why you gotta do that? Why you gotta do that? All right, so we know that there's some sparks that are able to carry more stuff. That's useful. Are these birch trees even going to be in the demo, or is it just going to be like a go fish sort of situation here? Let's, uh, maybe we can power that at some point. I don't know what the point would be. Let's just keep running around, see what we can find. I know I can't go out here because it's out of bounds. But maybe these guys can? Yeah, that seems fine. Can I, like, get them to pick stuff up for me, too? <laughs> what? Can we harvest out here? Oh, we can't throw up on top of the mountain. It's too high. It was worth a try. All right, so dead end understood. We need a Bielefant. What are those? What? Oh, they're mad. Oh, they're mad. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Attack! Get them! Oh my god. I think they're just destroying my guys. He's actually, they're actually just destroying. Come back, run away. Oh my God. Okay, so those guys mean business. Do not mess with them. They just destroyed all of my guys. <laughs> I got three left. I got three little babies left. Okay, we're gonna have to go make more. That is not going to work for a Bielefant. Whoo. All right, so I guess what we can do maybe is start making some swords. I think we're gonna need them. Then those guys are gonna be probably a little bit better at attacking things, I would hope. So we'll check it out here. I'm just doing a quick little, a quick little look-see. Can I loot this? What's in here? Nothing, I've already looted it probably. All right, let's go make a whole pile more sparks. See if we can get some swords started. Come on, I see another treasure over there. I just want to get through here. Perfect. Okay, we'll take all that. And where's my base? This way. Let's go home. Make some sparks and then make some swords. See if we can get ourselves defended up here. Okie dokie. Let's get a big old stack of 40 of those in there. That's going to make us a bunch more sparks. Big old stack of 40 in there. We need some more sparkies. More sparkies. You love to see it. I guess... No, I can't take this tree out of here. Ah, oh, I should have put this the other way. Can I, like, turn it? Or something? Or how do I break it? Am I able to break it? Edit tool? Ah, it's not even making it better. It won't let me do that. Okay, so this thing is just not going to work. <laughs> Till we can figure out how to get that tree out of there. Oh, that's a problem. Anyway, let me get some sparks. How do we make swords? The wood workshop? Let's see. What does this take? How do we make swords, please? Swords take planks and panels. Sawn timber and panels. 
What if... What if I move this? Build, move... Let's turn this sideways. And I think what we're gonna do... Is delete that. Run that into there. And then run this into there. I don't think I actually need two of those guys on there, but whatever, it'll work. So that's gonna make us saws. Not saws. Axes. Wait! Where's my crafty boys? They're faster. I'll put that guy in there. And... I am just gonna need a whole pile more of these guys. I forget the other thing that the crafters needed. Was it the pellets? It might have been the pellets. Anyway, I think this is fine for now. Everything seems to be working. Okay, we'll just let this run for a bit. Alright, we found the Belafont. The birch trees are right here. The brown colored things. And I am not going to fight that guy right now. I just wanted to see if we could find it. So that's what we're looking for. Now, I'm still working on making more swords. And I mean, we're making more of this pink stuff over here, which is good. Whoopsie daisy. I don't think we want to put all of it in there. We could put some. Okay. Looking good. Let's go see how many swords we have. I think I have six in my inventory right now. Five. I got five in my inventory right now. We may as well grab some wood from this machine on the way by. Just because we can't get the wood out of it otherwise. So we'll do that. And top up some of these machines. Let's load this bad boy up. We'll take that. Take those. We'll load that up. Okay. Make sure everything else is good to go. My swords. We got 12 now. It's not bad. It's not bad bad i think we want more i think we want more although we could start crafting those little boys where the heck are they here ancient ancient shrine choppy spark wait is this the one choppy right i think that's the one yeah yeah, yeah. we want choppies let's go over there and maybe i can get a few of these guys Starting to upgrade. A few is better than zero, and this is going to take a while, so we may as well get started. Okay, so we put 15 of those in here, and five wooden blades. And what do we get? It spits out a strange creature in your arms. The shrine knows Choppy Spark. Choppy Spark bows his head, ready and eager to receive instructions. Whee! Okay, we have three choppy sparks. And what does it take to make more? Three of those. And some of those. And obviously some of those. Perfect. Let's put these guys away. And I guess that is going to work. For now, I need more of these in here if I actually want this to work properly. It won't go higher than 10, it seems. So we're just going to have to wait. Let's go see how these choppy guys do against one of these. hi <laughs> Okay, well, I mean, it's fine. We can just do a little bit of farming while we wait. I kind of want to fight these guys and see what happens now that we've got our fancy new sword guys. There is four of them. Maybe I'll wait. I don't want to waste more of these guys. They take a while to make, so we'll wait until we're fully equipped and then we'll try it out and we'll see how it's going. What are we doing? We've got six of these guys now. We're making a few more. Um, it takes three for one. We need 18. So basically if I use up all of the stumpy sparks that I have left I think it's three and one. Yeah. Yeah, right there three and one 
If I use all of the stumpy sparks we have left, we will have a pile of choppy sparks. And I think that's probably our best bet to kill the Belafont. I don't know how many we're going to want. Probably a lot. I should probably make more. I don't know how big these stacks go. Maybe they go to 10 as well. It'd be nice if they went a little bit more. But 10 is fine. We can still hold 30 if that's the case. So I'll let that machine down there run a little bit. Let me go gather up some more gear. And hopefully we can get our pocket full of new and improved sparks. All right. So I'm just running around here doing some more checking out. And it hit me. I wonder if I can make a new shrine to make us the sword sparks, the choppy sparks, right here. Because we're already making these sparks. I've already got the swords. So I'm just wondering, whoops, if I can build a spark workbench. If I put this right here. Can I change the recipe, Stumpy? How do I change this from to something else that's not Stumpy? I don't think I can. So that sucks. We have to go to the other table. Anyway, whatever. It's fine. It was worth a try. So we've got a bunch more swords here. I made a couple extra crafty guys. And I might actually put them on these tables. Because these are slow. Put those guys on there. Okay. Let them go. We can put them on here as well. Let's get rid of these guys. And we got two more crafty guys to put on there. We'll take those. Make sure this is good and full. And we'll go set up a few more choppy sparks, I think. Make sure that's good and full. All right, it's looking pretty good. Almost time to fight, I think. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. All right, guys, check it out. We have 10 of the choppy sparks, 20 of them, actually, two stacks of 10. I'm going to call it there. Let's see how these guys fare against these like little web boys. Not a problem. Not even a little bit of a problem. So they can't harvest these, it seems. Nope. They're just giving themselves a headache. Okay, well, that's fine. We don't need them. Let's go try to take out a Belafont. See how that goes. Make sure we're set to the right guys here. And we'll go and we'll check this out. I should also make sure we're set up making more of uh, the stumpy sparks because we're just, we need a lot of them. Everything is expensive. These guys take three each, I think. And then the crafty ones, I think they take two each. So if we want to upgrade them, we need a pile. So I'm just going to go ahead. Make sure these things are still running the way they're supposed to be. And let's go head over and see if we can take out a Belafont. Man, I really hope 20 is enough. I don't see why it wouldn't be. Wait a minute. But we'll see. I, I almost killed one of those other guys with 30 of the stumpy shrine sparks. So we'll see. 20 of the choppies. Can, can maybe pull it off. We'll see how it goes. How, how are things looking down here? I wonder if we should just make some more crafters while we're... While we're hanging out. Let's do this. Uh... I guess if I put two of those guys in there temporarily... Uh, yeah, we'll do that. As soon as I make one, I'll swap it out. And then as soon as we make another one, I'll swap it out. And then this thing should go up. We're at 2.5 right now. We'll see how much it of an increase it is. It's definitely faster, but I don't know how much. We'll see here in a second. So the first one takes us up from 2.5 to 3.1, which is 0.6 out of 2.5. It's like a 24% increase. 
kind of a weird number. And then what does this guy do? 3.8. So two of them goes from 3.8 minus 2.6. It's like a 50% increase in speed. Which is pretty good. Okay, let's get all these things in here. I may as well make as many of these guys as we can. We're gonna need them. And then as soon as we run out of wooden panels, the Belafont is calling our name. Alright. That's the last one. Whoops. Let's see, what do we got here? Perfect! We got a whole bunch of crafters now. We are ready to go start upgrading our base at least a little bit. And make sure we're set to the right guys. I feel bad for this guy, but he is... He is in for it. See you later! Oh my god. They do so much damage. Oh no! He stunned them! Okay, he killed a few. He killed a few, but that's not bad. He only killed three. That's not bad. It still sucks. The fact that he killed any. I maybe should have waited until he used his stun attack and then thrown all the rest of the guys, but it is what it is. So we've killed the Belafont. Let's take these guys. Yoink. Oh yeah, look at that. Okay. I guess we can go hand in this quest. We're running out of stuff to do, guys. Let's go teleport home real quick. We don't have to walk. You love to see that. Off to the merchant, hey? Let's go do this. Complete. The merchant stares at you in disbelief as you recount your efforts to take down the Belafont. Their eyes flicker left and right as they try to mentally connect things together and finally they look at you. Hmm. I need to talk to the mayor about this. I don't think you or anyone else in this village actually understands what this means and how this will look to others. You've made something that can manufacture an army. Hmm. There's the saving grace that they're not particularly capable, but in the wrong hands, they're already capable enough. I'll have to take care of this. You can go. I have a lot of letters to write. Okie dokie. How is our quest log coming along? We're getting... Getting close. Crafty Sparks, the divine researcher wants us to make some crafty sparks. I just happen to have some, so maybe we'll have enough. Hello, sir. Oh ho ho! Didn't I tell you that there were other sparks? I'm so smart. I think you technically owe me a warm dinner, but I'll let you off for now. Deliver 10 crafty sparks. This is easy peasy. Wow, good thing we did that right before we came here. 10 of those. Was it 10 of these? I think it was 10, 10 of these. I think it was 10 and 10. Perfect. Yes, this is very simple. Oh, ho, ho. Chance truly favors the prepared mind. Let me show you. You'll find that setting it up will be as easy as rolling off a log. So can I now make these guys automatically? Is that what he just did for me? Or what What just happened? Quest log. Reward. Crafty spark. Grants access to quests in the next tier. The mayor! Wait, do we actually get to do stuff in the next tier? Or is this going to wrap it up here? Hello? Ah. I've heard you've been doing very well for yourself. And you've even found other spark thingies. Well, I'd like to see just how much you've progressed. If you could provide me with some, that'd be lovely. Ooh. 40 crafty sparks and 50 wooden blades. That's asking for a lot, lady. I don't know about all that. All right. Let's go see what we can put together here. So we're going to need... I'm hoping we're going to be able to change the recipe now. And actually start to be able to make some crafty sparks. Stumpy crafty. Perfect. Okay, we'll put some of these guys in here for now, I guess. And then we're going to need to make a path. Whoops. We're going to need to make a path from here to here. 
Uh, not from there, actually. From... Is it planks? I, uh, I can't remember if it's planks or, or boards. Panels. Okay. Let's connect this. We're going to need one of those crosswalk doohickeys. Now, this is going to be a long road. But we'll see how it how it works. We haven't built one of these yet, so let's see. Path. How do we build the road? Logistics crossing. We do this. Does that work? Like, is that gonna connect? Okay, I think... I think that's gonna work. So we're gonna need a few guys on here. That's a long path. One guy on here is probably good. And that is gonna start to make us crafty sparks over time. Okay, I can use this to keep making us the tier one sparks so that we always have some, which would be good. Because they are kind of uh, annoying. Everything takes so many. I think I'm probably gonna need some more in here. That's a long path. We'll see how that goes. Okay. First thing we're gonna upgrade is this thing itself so that, you know, it's crafting the crafters faster. Crafting the crafters. Alright, and then we're gonna let that run. We're also gonna need a pile of swords. So I think this is where we're gonna need a storage. Uh, where's the storage? Barrel? A basic place for your sparks to store items. Okay, we'll put that down somewhere. I guess I could just put it right there, right? Will this work? I can't. One square is not enough. <laughs> it was worth a try. One square is not enough for a bath, so we gotta go two. But that should work. So now these guys can go on here. And this guy's just gonna start storing swords. Perfect! This is exactly what we want. We just want them to store swords. Now, I don't know if there's an out. Is there an out on this thing? Let's see. I can't make another barrel right now because we don't have any more wood. But things are looking good. Things are looking really good. Let's go grab some wood really quick. I just want to see... When I go to build this, I saw an in. Yeah, there's an in, but there's no out. Which is not the best. But maybe there'll be an upgraded storage at some point. But anyway, guys, I think we're going to let this run for a little bit. We need to make a whole pile of sparks. I need 40 of these guys. And I think I also want to upgrade some of our manufacturing. Now, oh, you know what I want to do? I want to see if crafty sparks will increase this to 90% or 90 per minute. I feel like... They do! It's a 50% increase! Okay. So I am going to upgrade all of our manufacturing. Everything's going to get upgraded to crafters now that we're able to auto-craft these things. It's going to be so much better. And we're going to do that. I'm going to see where we end up. And then we'll go and we'll hand this mission in in the next one. Hopefully... We can unlock tier 3... Maybe even get looking into tier four. I don't know. We're gonna we're definitely gonna take a look at tier three though. That is coming up soon. So I am just going to finish upgrading our manufacturing. All this stuff's gonna get upgraded to crafter bots. And then we'll see where we end up. But guys, I hope you're liking the series so far. If you are, don't forget to leave me a thumbs up on this video. Subscribe to my channel if you're new here, and I will see you next time.